The United States of America is a market of more than 300 million people spread across 50 states and 9.8 million square kilometers, an area roughly equivalent to all of Europe. Electricity generation and delivery in the U.S. is governed by a complex network of federal, state, and local rules and regulations. Across the country, electricity is managed by and distributed across an overlapping patchwork of three interconnection zones, eight reliability regions, several organized competitive markets, and several less coordinated markets, all working together in real time to ensure reliable, affordable power delivery. For the less sophisticated and experienced developers, this balkanization is an obstacle to business, as each project, from California to New England, from North Dakota to Texas, requires a unique assessment of rules and regulations to operate successfully. Despite these hurdles, wind and solar energy have flourished in the United States, helped in no small part by $10 billion in private investment from Iberdrola Renewables alone. How do we do it? Here's a breakdown of how it all works. The continental U.S. is divided into three different electricity interconnections. There's the Eastern Interconnection, the Western Interconnection, and the Electric Reliability Council of Texas, which includes most of Texas. Going a level deeper, the North American Electric Reliability Corporation works with eight regional entities to ensure the grid doesn't fail, causing blackouts. The Federal Energy Regulatory Commission, FERC, is responsible for regulating wholesale electricity markets outside of ERCOT. This generally breaks down into two types. Type 1 is organized competitive markets operated by independent system operators, ISO, or regional transmission organizations, RTO. These markets are generally more attractive to renewable power developers. The ISO, or RTO, manages the transmission system and individual owners and operators of generation submit offers to run their generation on a competitive basis. Additionally, generation, transmission, and retail service can be owned by separate entities within these regions. In our second type, regulated bilateral markets, electric utilities are vertically integrated and therefore control the transmission system and choose which generation to dispatch. Each individual market is complex. Let's take MISO as an example. It's the largest ISO in the U.S. and one of the largest power grid operators in the world. MISO's service area encompasses 15 states, one Canadian territory, and 2.3 million square kilometers, almost double the size of Spain, France, and Germany combined. MISO operates across four different reliability regions and is comprised of 36 balancing authorities. While complicated, Iberdrola Renewables has acquired the expertise and developed the technologies to successfully develop renewable energy resources across the U.S. This is especially true in the New England ISO. Iberdrola Renewables has operated here since 2008, building and operating 101 megawatts of wind power at three facilities, enough to power 26,058 homes. We are committed to providing reliable, affordable power to our customers, and we have the technology and experience to deliver it. Our business isn't just finding where the wind blows and the sun shines. It's about being able to leverage over a decade of proven performance to plug into any kind of market, competing with more established energy sources, and building trust with our partners each and every time. From the wheat fields of Oregon, deserts of Arizona, cornfields of Illinois to the hills of New Hampshire. We combine cutting-edge technology, electricity market trading know-how, and our extensive experience managing renewable energy projects to compete even when the sun doesn't shine and the wind doesn't blow. At the center of this operation is Iberdrola Renewables National Control Center, or NCC. The NCC is professionally staffed 24 hours a day, 7 days a week, 365 days a year, and is the nerve center of the company's owned and contracted power generation portfolio. Iberdrola Renewables operates facilities in many regional markets, each with their unique regulations and protocols. 
The NCC maintains compliance with all of these region's regulations. NCC dispatchers coordinate in real time with the nation's various transmission system operators to ensure that the lights stay on. Building on the best practices of its parent company in Spain, where renewables can power 50% of the country at any given time, the NCC is particularly important to the company's future plans in the U.S. market. As American electricity consumers seek more fuel diversity, resources like wind will become more desirable and valuable when integrated efficiently across the patchwork of regions and regulators. Iberdrola Renewables National Control Center is already doing this, setting an example for the rest of the industry to follow. Through state-of-the-art technology and sophisticated energy dispatch and trading personnel, we are working to make renewable energy even more mainstream. With innovative technology, improved forecasting, and a diverse portfolio of renewable energy generation, we are overcoming the challenges that faced renewable energy just five or ten years ago. While energy markets are anything but simple, Iberdrola Renewables has the technology and the know-how to navigate them. The future for clean energy and Iberdrola Renewables is bright.